Feeling like a freight train, flying like an airplane, feeling like a space brain one more time tonight. Yeah! Well, I'm on a night train. <laughs> anyway, uh, this is the uh, prediction for the December 10th fight between Amir Khan and Lamont Peterson for the WBA Super World of Awesomeness title and IBF. Just keep adding words, man. This is just a title, man. It's a title. It's WBA. Okay. Now I'll break down both fighters, and then I'll give my prediction at the end. I'll start out with Amir Khan, who's 26-1 and one with 19 or 18 knockouts for a 67% knockout ratio. Uh, he's absolutely in his prime. Another five months at light welterweight. Uh, went from uh, a looking a bit rough fight against McCloskey to completely blowing out and dominating Zab Judah. Amir Khan is a better boxer than a boxer and a better puncher than most punchers. He's a very deadly combination of speed, speed, and, and, uh, and speed. Isn't that right, Aguardo? Shut up, man. You did so fast you didn't even know what I was saying. Um, you know, he, he's got a very tight D. He's very accurate. He's now becoming a bit more aggressive as he gets more confident and um, comfortable at this weight. He uh, keeps his distance. He pounds that jab and the straight right hands in there. Works the head to body. He gets in. He gets out. Um, he, he can throw any punch there is. And did I say he pounds the body? Ask Miranda about that one. When, you, when you're looking at that, his chin is no longer an issue. Uh, I believe he is an excellent boxer, and he has the heart to do it. That war with Miranda, and that's what it was, is a war of attrition, and he won. He came out on top. He stood in there. He got hit. He got hit hard. And he was still standing at the end of it. Going over to Lamont Peterson, who's 9-1-1, who's 2-1-1 in his last four fights. Uh, he's got 48% knockout ratio, by the way. Just throw that out there, too. Um, his two wins were knockouts, but they weren't over, like, great, great people. I mean, Victor Cayo, that, that was a good win. Good knockout in the 12th over Victor Cayo, but the other, other guy, not, nothing much there. Uh, had the draw with Ortiz, which is shocking, but it also tells you a little bit about his chin. Uh, he was dropped twice in that fight, but he was able to get up and continue and pull out a draw against Victor Ortiz, so that shows his heart. It also shows that Victor Ortiz can't handle boxers very well. But, you know, he, he is a good boxer, he, but not that good of a boxer, because he turned around and before that he did get spanked by Bradley. You know, so... You know, in, in fact, he was dropped against Bradley, so, you know, Chin comes in even more question. Uh, good boxer with good speed. He's got okay power. He's, uh, the Khan is by far the best fighter he's fought yet. Uh, the stamina uh, would have been a question, but he has won 12 rounds before. He's got a nice tight D with a good jab that works the head and body. He throws with aggression, not with power, but with aggression. And a lot of hooks, but he can get a bit, a bit wide with those. He counter punches, but he drops his hands when he starts to open up. Now, he can throw all the punches as well. He can He likes to work inside, and has good. As I said, he's got the good heart, but that chin is definitely a question. I mean, while I say he he made it through, you know, he he did get dropped. And Ortiz's knockdowns are different than Khan's knockdowns. Ortiz's is more of a blunt force trauma. Khan's are like a lightning flash bolt of lightning. And, and you handle those differently. You know, when, when they happen, they still hurt like hell. But they're just different with the brain, the, the movement in the brain, with the with the speed of the punches. Uh, looking at this, I see this as a very solid uh, unanimous decision win for Khan, if not even Khan pulling out the knockout late. I, I won't throw out both. I'll stick with one, and I will go with the unanimous decision for Khan knockout in the 10th. Okay, well, all right, you guys, um, hopefully uh, I've put out enough videos now for this past day to kind of keep you satiated just for a minute anyway, so I can pump out some more later on in the week. All right, well, hey, this is Big Ragu, or Guardo, whatever. Comment, rate, subscribe, be my friend, be, be Guardo's friend. I'm going to fire Guardo. Don't tell him. I think I'm going to fire him. All right, well, hey, Big Ragu, I'm out.